Hello everyone. Welcome to this another video on CSS transition by Simply Learn. The CSS transition property is the simplest way to add the animation to our website. And in this video, we are going to see how to use it. So, animation is a good way to catch attention on the page. And if done properly, it increases the user experience. The most basic way to animate something is by transition. According to the MDN definition, transition enables you to define the transition between two states of an element. Basically, when the state of an element changes, such as hover, focus, or anything else, we can change the CSS property through a transition. There are a handful of transition property. Let's discuss what they are and how they work. So, we are on our code pen. I have a box that changes the color on the hover. The first property that we are going to start is with the transition duration property. The transition duration property specifies how many seconds or milliseconds a transition effect takes to complete. So here I can write transition duration and I can write here a number. Take note that here we can enter time in milliseconds or seconds. I will suggest you to use the millisecond since JavaScript does not accept time in second. So I will enter here 500 milliseconds. Now when you go here and hover over this box, you will see the color changes from pink to green in about 500 milliseconds. Let's change this to say 2 seconds and see the difference. Now if you hover over this box, you will see it takes 2 seconds to change the color from pink to green. The next one we are going to look is a transition property. The transition property sets the CSS properties to which a transition effect should be applied. Suppose we want to rotate this box when hovered over. So first we will specify the transform property here and we will set it to rotate 45 degrees. Now here we will specify the transition property and set it to transform. Now if you hover over this box, you will see it takes about 500 milliseconds for the box to rotate to 45 degrees while the color changes instantly. Suppose we set it here to 2 seconds and save. Now you will notice the box will take to about 2 seconds to rotate to 45 degrees while the color will change instantly. You can see the difference here. Now the next property is transition timing function. The transition timing function property specifies the speed curve of the transition effect. The default value is ease. Ease means it specifies the transition effect with a slow start and then fast and then end slowly. Suppose here we'll set the transition timing function. to ease. There are four major values for this timing function. They are ease, linear, ease in and ease out. Let's see one by one in detail. So the linear function specifies the transition effect with the same speed from start to end. So if we change here to linear. You will see that it rotates with the same speed from start to end. Now if we change this to ease in, the ease in specifies the transition effect with a slow start. So now if you hover over this, you will see the box rotates with a slow start and then increases the speed at the end. The ease out specifies the transition effect with a slow end. So if you set it to ease out. You will see at the end the speed decreases. The last property we are going to discuss is the transition delay. The transition delay property specifies when the transition effect will start. The transition delay value is defined in milliseconds or in seconds. Let's set the 
ट्रांजिशन डिले टू टू सेकेंड्स एंड जस्ट रिमूव दिस नाउ इफ यू होवर ओवर दिस बॉक्स यू सी इट विल टेक टू सेकेंड्स टू रोटेट द बॉक्स टू फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री so you can see after the 2 seconds the transition property takes place now if we change here to background you see the box will rotate instantly while the color will changes from pink to green after 2 seconds so this is a transition property is it as simple as it can be i hope you like this video if yes please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe thank you and happy learning hi there if you like this video subscribe to the simply learn youtube channel and click here to watch similar videos to nerd up and get certified click here